see the blepar spasm. Blepar spasm is the forceful contraction of the eyelid muscles. And here, the, the patient could have this as part of a an antipsychotic medication, so it would be an adverse effect of drugs, the antipsychotic medications. So in this case, the adverse effect is the acute dystonia. In this case, this is focal dystonia, the dystonia. It's just this uh, painful contraction, and so the patient cannot open the, the eyes. Sometimes this could also be associated with the, uh, in, in the acute dystonia, this could be other things like movement of the uh, eyes, looking upward and cannot move them, etc. So this is a focal dystonia, the blepharus, and this forceful contraction of the eyelids. But also can be seen, for example, in Parkinson's disease. But most of the times it is idiopathic. So we don't know the cause, and the patient just have the blepharus, so usually it is triggered by bright light. So the, the avoidance for just mild cases, the treatment for mild cases is just the avoidance of the trigger. In severe patients or with significant uh, symptoms, the treatment could be botulin toxin. And things that can, um, let's say, revert the spasm is if you touch the, the um, skin around the eyelid or you rub the skin or something like that. Um, so this would be called the uh, tick. Usually this is bilateral and symmetrically, so the blepharospasm is just the forceful contraction of the eyelids, usually idiopathic, there is no treatment to do unless there are significant symptoms, in which case we would give botulin toxin. But remember, this is just what um, normally is done. These are videos are just for uh, medical students and not for patients. So we don't want anybody to do anything about this. If it is a patient, we are just doing these videos for medical students.